So now what you're about to see is the blooper um, of my my mistake. So here is me just la 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 going along doing all 24 tags um, the wrong way. So watch this. Okay, this next step, which you see I've already done on these ones, is to use the dauber tops um, of the ink, of uh, the paint that I got. Um, so let's show you what I did. And you can see my craft net is a mess. Oh, it's a real big mess, isn't it? Um, let me just get my tripod set up. Let's see what I'm going to do. Alright, so all I'm doing is I'm taking the wicker white and just daubing it on top all around. Okay. Then I'm taking the sky blue. And you don't have to worry about contamination because when you're all done, all you do is wipe off the top and it never gets inside. Um, that's how the dauber tops work. Okay. And I'm taking, oh sorry, uh, the clips of sky and doing a couple of those that just add some highlights. Okay. Okay, so it looks like that. All dauber toppy and wonderful. Okay. Then you just pounce up and down. I got this idea from a Tim Holtz um, Christmas tag that he did in, I think it was his 2008 collection. Um, so basically I'm just trying to recreate it. So, it's not totally my design, but and then there's a couple spots where I want to add just a little bit where you just want to get it all covered. Okay, and this is adding highlights and low lights and whatnot. Okay, and once it's all covered, set it aside to dry, and then, oops, oops I got something on. Okay, so you set it aside to dry, and then when they're all done, um, when they're all done drying, which will be a little bit, um, and they're not done. So I'll be back once they're dry and we'll go on to the next step. Thanks. Okay, so here are the tags. Um, and in hindsight, I would probably um, paint them and then brush it off right away. Um, but since I let them all dry, <coughs> um, it's a little bit more difficult to take off the stuff. So what I do is I'm missing all over it to kind of re-moisten that paint. Okay, so it's got a lot of water on there. I'm just kind of swirling it where I want it to come off. Okay, then I'm taking a baby wipe with some blending solution. Just, I don't know why, it's just it's not coming off as easily as I would have hoped. Make sure I'm still on camera. Okay, then you just rub it's also hard to see like where it's supposed to come off so you just rub like so and there enters your snowman okay you just have to be careful though because you don't want to rub too hard or you take off the other paint okay I'm just gently rubbing. Get it off camera. Um, circular motions seem to work well. snowman back. Okay, not quite as perfect as it was, but I think that's sort of a look that this is supposed to make. It's sort of um, distressed. Okay. You don't see those? See there? Where that happened? That's not supposed to happen. It's 
not supposed to happen there either. So, if that happens, I'm just going to re. Color there, dollars. Okay, very gently. Rub. And because stipples are going over this, I have to put an element over that one because that one's not. That is why I would not let them dry, is because that's what's happening, and that's not supposed to happen. So, I'm going to try it again. The embossing powder is still there. So, I'm just going to let that dry a little bit and try again. Okay, so here are two that I've done. I'm taking this stuff off of. Okay. So I'm just going to continue that process and hopefully salvage as many as I can. Um, and then if I have to redo a few, I will. So then I'll so use the Sami paint everything and let them all dry overnight because that's what the directions from Tim Holtz said to do. Um, and let me just show you what happens. And I, you see it on the video a little bit, um, or you'll see it in just a second. But let me just show you a close-up of what that looks like. Yeah, his nose is no longer a nose. And the detail isn't really there. And it's just bad. And when you see it in comparison to this one, do you see the difference? It's just night and day um, when I do it right away. So... I didn't want you ladies to have any ones that were, weren't perfect, so um, these, all 24 of these guys, trash. Yep, they go in the trash, so hope you liked my big mistake. Um, and sometimes, you know, when you make a mistake like that and you just don't know it and you're just like, crap, it's totally ruined. I tried to fix it. I did. I tried. I tried to fix it. I tried putting more paint on and it didn't work. So sometimes you just have to cut your losses, use it as a learning experience, and say, that's it. I'm starting all over. And that's what I decided to do. So I hope you like your tags, and um, thanks for watching. And I can't wait to see what all you guys came up with. Um, I can't wait to get my tags back. So thanks a lot. Thanks for watching.